Uh, so hi everyone today we'll talking about how you can perform basic mathematical operations alongside symbolic mathematics and word problems using lang chain so basically we won't be use uh, if you know llms have a limitation in mathematics because while training they use huge corpus of text data sets and they don't use mathematical data sets so eventually they have certain limitations while going with complex mathematical problems that i will be demonstrating as well ki why we should be using lang chains for mathematics rather than You straight away using LLM. So let's get started. So basically, first of all, to perform, we will be dividing this tutorial into three parts. One is basic mathematics, other symbolic mathematics, and the third one is word problems. So let's get started. First of all, we will pipin solve a few packages that is Lang Chain and OpenAI. Apart after that, we will be creating an OpenAI object and then a LLM Math Chain from this LLM object that we have created using OpenAI. We are passing the API key. Now, first of all, we are running one of the examples. What is 13 raised to the 0.3432 power? Now, here you can see that it is able to perform and giving an answer 2.411. Now, if I run the same question in the free version of ChatGPT, that is default ChatGPT GPT 3.5, here you can see that the response is wrong. That is 2.97. And just for confirmation, if you check the internet, you get it 2.411. That is the first answer given by Langchain is correct. Secondly, is that uh, what is thirteen point eight seven multiplied fifteen point three four minus three point three two? So the answer is two hundred nine point four four five. And as you can see, that it is able to perform this operation as well. Now, if I go to GPT three point five, here you can see that what the results comes up. So you can see that uh, there are some issues with the decimal places two hundred nine point one seven five eight. Whereas the actual answer is 209.4458 that I've already checked. So basically, as you can see that uh, using straight up LLMs is not a great idea for basic mathematics, and you should be using Lang chains. Now in the sex, uh, in the next tutorial, we will be solving out symbolic mathematical problems. So in symbolic mathematical problems, basically we will be using symbols like um, sine, cosine, exponential, tan, etc. So uh, in this case, there will be slight changes. So instead of LLM math chain, we will be using LLM symbolic math chain. And then we will be uh, the rest of the process remains the same. We will be passing the API to the OpenAI object, and then eventually using the LLM symbolic math chain from LLM, we will be uh, assigning that LLM that we have created using the OpenAI object. So you can see that the first question that we are running is what is the derivative of sine x into exponential x with respect to x? We are able to get an answer. Similarly, what is the integral? And then solve for x, y, z. Here we are able to get answers for that also. So this is how you can perform symbolic mathematics. Using LLM symbolic math chain. The last one being uh, word problems. So in word problems, it is seen that LLMs usually hallucinates a lot. So to avoid that, we'd be using a PAL chain, that is programmatically aided language chain. So in the first example, we use LLM math chain. In the second example, we use LLM symbolic math chain. Now we'll be using a PAL chain here. So again, the process remains uh, very similar. Uh, there are two types of chain that can be used: conditional PL chain or PL chain. So we will be demonstrating using the PL chain from math prompt. LM equals to LLM. LLM is again similar to, uh, is equal to the OpenAI object that we are creating using the API key. Here is the question that we are sending it. Tim buys the same number of pets as Cindy and Boris. Cindy buys the same number of pets as Bill plus Bob. And it's a long question. Now eventually the final question is: if Bob, if Obama buys one pet, how many pets total total pets does everyone buy? So if we run this particular question in this PL chain, here you can see that how uh, the LM is how the Lang chain is able to solve this whole problem and giving us an answer five. So in this way we can solve uh, three types of basic mathematical problem that is basic math, symbolic math, word problems using Lang chain.